What's banging bass head? You're no support for this legend here. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to wire up your after and etc. Uh, come with me to the back. So, in my side, my hand on a one kicker Solex tank on a JL1000 uh, slash one on a 170 amp hour AGM battery. Um, so, let's get straight to the video. Alright, so let's get into this video. So I did zero gauge from the car, pretty fat, and I, I was able to fit it in there. So you take your battery out, and then you're gonna see a little circle that's covered by a, like a rubber circle thing. Depends if you still got it on there. It should be. If it is, take a flat head, pop it out. And really just start jamming your wire in and you'll come here. Oh. And you'll literally see it coming from there. As you can see guys, I did not fully like hide it. It's way too cold out here in Canada. I just did a quick run. So yeah, that's where it's gonna come out of. And then you can just like run it to the back. Right here. Like I said, I did a quick install. It's too cold out here. And it just goes to the back. And like that, you can wire your sub and your amp. As in for RCAs, I have it running through my Pioneer deck. If you guys don't have a radio or whatever, singled in, doubled in, you guys are gonna have to figure that out because I don't know if this car is a stock sub or if you guys can tap into a speaker to get sound, but that's how I have it done. Just like that. That's how you wire your Acura Integra through 94 to 2001. Your older Integra is, I don't know. So yeah, guys, it's Blaze Legend, and I'm out. Peace.